So in order to remove this, I, I guess we could call this uh, the, the, the riser stage. I, I don't know. I'm just um, trying to choose terminology that would seem understanding to the viewer. So this uh, riser base here where our dice are threaded onto, we have these two top caps and they'll need to be removed. But before we can remove that, we need to remove this entire handle assembly and it doesn't look like you know we're going to be able to remove uh, it here we have to begin with a handle the handle is everything to this so let's go ahead and uh, take this apart Pretty uh, heavy setup, actually. This is uh, obviously a, a very uh, bull stout uh, press. There's nothing this light duty about it. I don't want to lose anything here. So now, uh, the arm is pinned in to this pivot, it, whatever we want to call that. So, kind of looks like remove these snap rings. Do not want to lose those. one uh, putting off a lot of a lot of leverage off this compound system it's uh, incredibly strong uh, very neat design so I'm going to mark this uh, after the video right hand side Very neat. Left hand side. And I wasn't sure if I was going to leave these on or off, but for now I think the best place to keep these is uh, just on position. You can't, can't go wrong losing them there. seated in there like that. Kind of cool. Maybe when we get into this we'll find a whole entire V8 motor. Who knows? A little small block in this, you know. Yeah. Okay. Looks like we got those two entire handle assembly, the right arm, left arm with the pivots off. Guys and gals, that's the end of this video. God bless. We'll see you on the next.